Good morning, this is Carrie Prince from Apollo Career Center, and this morning we are going to make some buffalo chicken pinwheels. Um, it's good game day food. I've got eight ounces of softened cream cheese in this mixing bowl. I'm going to start off with uh, adding to that mixing bowl some green onion. Who doesn't love buffalo chicken? I do. And these are really great. You can make these ahead so you're not in the kitchen during the during the game or, or any of your other preparations there. All right, we've got about a half a cup of blue cheese crumbles. If you don't like blue cheese, you can omit that, obviously. We're going to do just over a half a cup. This is one five ounces. Probably could have used my whole thing here. Five ounces of Frank's Red Hot or the Buffalo Wing Sauce, whichever one you like. And again, if you like things really spicy, you can add a little bit more. If you don't, pull some out. Quarter teaspoon of garlic powder. And I'm going to mix this together. Oh, it smells good. Even in this early morning, it smells good. I really can smell that blue cheese. Now, if you really, if you don't like blue cheese, you could add cheddar. More cheddar, I should say. Okay. I'm gonna add three cups of shredded chicken. Now, I went and purchased this out of the deli. Um, I'm gonna go three hand, good size handfuls for three cups. That's so easy, easy, easy way to get your chicken. You know, rotisserie chicken is so flavorful. And uh, they have it all picked and ready to go for you. So here's your, this is our mixture that we're gonna roll into our tortillas. All right, so let me move this over here. Now, any size flour tortilla that you want, I get the 10 inch uh, tortillas, and we're just gonna add, put some of this mixture down. Now, the recipe says for you to refrigerate this uh, once you rolled it up. That's just gonna make it easier to cut. We're gonna go ahead and cut them this morning so you can see what it's like if you just make them and eat them right away. Either way, you can do. And I'll just do the one here for us. Okay, just spread that to a, as even of a layer as you can. That chicken's pretty chunky. I'm gonna roll that up. Pull my cutting board back. I don't want to cut on the table. All right, seam side down. I've got a little bit extra filling in there. Take your edges off so you can square that up. Those are good little taste testers for whoever's in your kitchen with you. And then we're just going to, whatever thickness you want, I like about a half inch thickness for these. And then just put them on your plate. Ooh, they look good, they smell good. These are buffalo chicken pinwheels. Great for Super Bowl, great for any day, if you ask me, but these and all of the recipes can be found at ApolloCareerCenter.com and First Edition will be right back. 